Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Maury's Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing Let's Go to the City or City Folk. Uh, we are of course rocking the speed racer superhero kind of zap helmet. Uh, just to do something a little bit different. I wouldn't normally wear an accessory like this so I feel like it's time just to step out of our comfort zone a little bit and try some new things. Um, hey Octavian, come and tell me. Have a chat, are we? Um, we should have the Nooks upgrade today, so we'll check that out first. But first, before we get into things, I just want to know, are you still enjoying this series? Do you think you'll watch it for some time? Are there any other games you'd like to see played alongside this? Would you prefer some streaming? Let me know your thoughts early on in the comments, just so I know, uh, so I can gauge what, make sure, I just wanna make sure everyone's having a good time, basically. But let's get into it. We should have a Nooks upgrade. Here we go. And we have, what's it called again? Nook and Go, yes! And also, it's snowing for the second time today. Oh, check out our Nook and Go. Love the sign. It kind of looks like a petrol station, like here in England. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm excited to go and check out some new items. But before we do, we mustn't forget our daily task of watering our beloved red turnip. Um, it doesn't seem to be growing on the outside. I can just hope that underneath the ground it's, it's getting bigger. Um, okay, uh, we also, in case you missed yesterday, we also have a slightly bigger house. So we're still working on our feng shui. We need some yellow items to increase our money luck so we can get more bell bags out of the money rock. Um, but we also, we also have our turnips. So today's probably going to be one of those days where we just get around to doing a few chores, talk with the villagers, uh, and just do some of our daily routine, but first... Oh, look at all... You can see the items through the windows. What? Has that always been a thing? You can literally see all the wallpapers in the back there. Uh, yes. Welcome. Uh, welcome to exciting grand opening of Nook and Go. And we've got two flowers. No way. Two chess pieces. Yes. We love the chess pieces here on this channel. We tried to make a chess room in... The in New Leaf on the 3DS, but it, we just could never find the pieces. Oh, finally, there's an axe as well. Okay, oh, I'm so hyped for um, for some chess pieces. We don't really have a use for them, but we have to buy them, don't we? How much are they? Yes, a black pawn, it costs 1,100 bells. Quite a bargain. For a chess piece, I guess that is, is a bargain. Probably gonna be the cheapest piece. Um, uh, yes, we'll, we'll take it. I'm not quite sure how much the bigger one is going to cost us though, but we want to get all the chess pieces. Just because they're so cool. I just, I don't know why they were never added to New Horizons. It's such a shame. Um, oh, very good, Maury. You have a good eye. That's today's special. It's a white king. Just eight, whoa, 8,000 bucks. Okay, we're going to have to save up for that chess piece. Um, never mind. Yeah, we'll have to... We'll have to save up for that. Let's see, what's this? A trunk measure, 1,680 bells. That's an interesting item, but I don't know if we have a use for it just yet. We probably should save our bells until we have found the money rock or something. Okay, and of course, um, if in case you missed yesterday's episode, you probably should watch it, it's quite fun. And um, we also hooked up a USB keyboard and writing out letters using the keyboard is so funny because it's, it's just, a, it's kind of a modern gaming thing to do in like what probably now is considered a retro game. <laughs> um, quite a bargain, yes? Yeah, we want to buy the flowers anyway because we have noticed some grass deterioration, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, so we want to kind of slow it down a little bit. We want to enjoy some of the grass. By the time the snow disappears, we want to have some actual grass there to see before it completely disappears. So we've got to slow things down. Um, part of it means using the same running routes, I guess, because the paths are inevitable, the grass deterioration. But if we slow it down and we don't walk on everywhere, it, it should be okay. Okay, we'll check out the carpet and the path. Uh, path. <laughs> the carpet and the wallpaper when we come back to buy the other chess piece. Um, yeah, we should probably go and plant these flowers. Do some chores. We need to give that bug to Blathers before we accidentally sell it. Because we always accidentally sell things. We have a bad habit of keeping things in our pocket to try and keep them safe. And then accidentally losing them or selling them. Um, but look at this. Look and go. I'm so hyped. Nook's, upgrading Nook's Cranny is like one of the funnest side quests in, uh, in this game, I, I believe. Anyway. 
Um, okay, Octavian, hey. Oh, we forgot to check the turnip prices. Hey, Maury, what are you up to, sucker? Take this. Oh, we can give things to villagers now. Oh, we can. We haven't got anything to give. I'm sorry. Uh, where's my pointer gone? Oh, there it is. Oh, thank you so much for getting my hopes up, then smashing them into pieces like all my dreams. Oh, wow. Oh, no, don't fight. Don't fall out. Oh, yes, here's our happiness. Look. Yay. So there is a quick way to do it. Rod's just like pushing Octavian out of the way. Okay. Let's have a little walk around town, see who else is around. Um, I wonder what is another good way of getting furniture items? Because we could really do with finding some more yellow furniture to boost our feng shui. I have a, a worry that we're going to encounter bees. Let's just see if we can get our... There we go. We'll head back to... Oops. We'll head back to Nook's... Okay, I need to press right to get the net out quickly. We'll head back to Nook shortly. We'll just have a couple things to do first, because we need to find out the turnip prices in Nook, so we'll definitely have to go back before the end of the day. But I really want to find that there should be at least one furniture item around town every day. Oh, money! Thank you. We'll take that. Apollo, hey! Nice to see you not staring in... Uh, Gladys's windows today. <laughs> we found loads of money doing this last time. But we also found lots of bees. Oh, what was that? A regal dresser. Wait a minute, didn't we s didn't we send that to someone? How weird, we literally sent a regal dresser to someone the other day. But we can keep that maybe for writing some letters. Um, what else do we... Misty shirt. Now that it's in our catalogue, we could probably get rid of that. So we'll send that as well. We want to keep that. Donate the bug. And plant our flowers. Where should we plant our flowers? What colours have we got? White, pansy, white cosmos. Okay. Let's see. Maybe we should start planting on the other side of the bridge. Because the grass is also deteriorating the other side of the bridge. This area around Nooks has already gotten bigger, I feel like. Okay, let's plant them here. There we go. And we'll just do it either side of the bridge because as much as I hate to admit it, a path is probably going to form anyway. Um, I'm just going to empty my pockets here temporarily. These scallops, we're just going to drop here. We'll donate that to Blathers. We'll keep this and this for gifts. Okay. Now we should be good to go see Blathers. I think we'll just donate the bug to Blathers first. Is there a glowing spot in this game? Can we make a money tree? How do we make a money? I haven't seen a glowing spot at all. Do we have to have the golden shovel maybe? We're checking the beach out of habit at this point. No. Just keeping our eyes open for any scallops, just in case they are the right ones. I wonder if we've just been unlucky and haven't actually come across a glowing spot. It would be really sad if they didn't exist in this game. Sand dollar. <laughs> Highlight it. There we go. No. Wow. Uh, uh, oh, that's a big fish. No. Ma well, the, the scallops must be rarer than I thought then. We found three on the first day. We gave one away in a letter. We haven't seen any since. Sand dollar. Oh, interesting. So maybe they are rarer than I thought. We probably shouldn't have sent one in the letter. <laughs> okay, let's go and give this to Blathers. This little centipede. 
And then we can find the the money rock, I guess. I, I do wish there was another way to get items, though. Because obviously we've got Gracie Grace in the city, who does, like, expensive items. And the only other way is Nooks. Uh, ooh! Oh, I beg your pardon. I'm a bit of a night owl, don't you know? In any case, allow me to welcome you to the Moriland Museum. Thank you, Blathers. We're excited just to give you a centipede. Uh, am I, I am at your service. Okay, donation. Hooty hoo! Is that so? What shall you donate? <laughs> Sweets, a uh, suspense. Okay, here we go. Have a centipede with a gazillion legs. Ooh, I dare say that is a centipede. Stop! Do not free it! Leave the beast caged! Insects rather bother me. Touching them strikes me as quite revolting! Yeah, Blathers has never really liked the, uh, the whole bug situation. <laughs> if the beast attacks us, how will we flee to safety? <laughs> I, I, uh, I can't help but think you're overreacting slightly to this little critter. Enough said, I say our uh, thanks for the donation. We shall endeavour to keep the wretch safe and uh, happy. Do you wish to donate anything else? Not at this time. I salute your patronage. I trust we may continue to rely on your generosity. Well, we'll do our best. Um, we should probably have a quick look in the roost just to see if there's any villagers hanging about. I don't think there, there will be, but... Oh, wait! Filbert, hey! Is it true that real men like bitter coffee? I guess I'm just a regular guy then, because I like my coffee light and sweet. I like my coffee light and sweet too. Can I have a coffee? Care for some coffee? It'll run you 200 bells, but it's well worth it. Yes, please. I don't know, is there any other purpose to the roost other than KK's performances? And do we unlock anything with the roost? I think it is in this game, isn't it, where we get the... The gyroid storage, but do we unlock that by buying coffee? Or is there anything else that we can unlock? Uh, I brew only my own handcrafted blends here. Good for you. Brewster looks smaller in this game as well. I said that about the chickens yesterday that we saw in the city. What is up with that? They seem to have shrunk. Drink up before it gets cold. Fresh from the pot is the only way. Thank you. Yeah, we don't want to offend Brewster. Ah, now that is satisfying. I feel like I've been bathing in coffee beans. Okay, well, thanks for the coffee. Filbert is just kind of staring at his. Thank you. I always start to get sleepy around noon. Too sleepy even to pick up the cup. Oh, no. I wonder if Brewster would pour the coffee directly into my mouth if I asked him nicely. Uh, now that would be awesome. Yeah, that's that's the ultimate laziness that is Okay, let's head back through the museum and then back to the Moriland town. Oh Blathers back asleep again <laughs> Doesn't take him long to sleep does it? Um, but we'll head back to town now, and I guess we'll there's no other way I can think of of getting Getting items other than if we talk to villagers we need some things in our pockets to give to the villagers. Let's um, carry some oranges and see if see if we can give an orange to Octavian. Where did Octavian go? Kusto, hey! Actually, while we're up here, we may as well check the Able Sisters. If I can get <laughs> if I can get in the door. Sometimes I'm pressing the button, it's just not doing anything. I think it's because the Wii Mote's not always pointing at the screen. Hi there, welcome to the Handmade Fashion Palace of the Able Sisters. Okay, we're gonna make a point of talking to Sable. I don't know if it does anything in this game. But just in case. I'm a bit busy right now! Oh, okay. What do we got here? What's this? A chef hat, is it? That's a chef's hat! The price on this item is 160 bells. With matching clothes, that will look scream, chef! Um, we'll take it. I wanna get some things in the catalog, but we'll, we'll probably send it to a villager or something. Oh, a big bro mustache! Uh, the item will run you exactly 600 bells. Can we try it on? <laughs> we, unfortunately, we can't have it with the racing helmet. Um, I'll take it, though. 
Woo, I forgot that made a noise when you put the racing helmet on. Okay, yeah, that'll do. Um, okay, yeah, let's go and back to... Let's find the money rock first. Because uh, it doesn't look like we're going to find any more yellow items um, around town. So we just have to be patient when it comes to trying to design a nice feng shui layout. But we can really use the money rock right now, so... Okay. The one thing I like about this game is the shovel doesn't break. Nope. If we don't walk on the same areas, it will take the take longer for the grass to deteriorate, but then eventually it will all deteriorate. So we should definitely try and stick clo close to to the buildings and stuff, I think. We should probably try and map out a pathway. Um, what do you think? Should we just walk freely and not worry about the grass, or should we map out pathways? Let me know! Oh, we've got a message. Uh, Nook special. This just in. We just received a rare piece. A white king in our showroom. Nook and go. Cool. What's this? Is there any more? Oh, Nook and go. We've decided to remodel our store to serve you better. We hope you like our improved service. Nook news. Hurry. It's finally here. The 15th January is point special day when you earn five times the points. Oh, 15th of January. Wait, is it the 5th? No, it's not the 15th today, is it? Okay, we definitely have to do some shopping on the 15th then. Uh, I'm struggling to remember where the rocks are. But yes, it doesn't seem like a glowing spot is in the game. Well, there's three fossils just in this area here. And there's one down by the beach. One near the bridge, I think. Yeah, this is definitely going to be a, a slightly calmer day. I apologise. But it's nice to have ones where we don't necessarily do something new. And we kind of just enjoy going around town. I'm really bad at keeping on the same paths. It's hard to... Re unless we map them out, it's really hard to know which paths... We're trying to stick to you. <laughs> uh, I don't think there's any rocks this way. If we stay on the beach, this is definitely a good way to get from one side of the island to the other without destroying the grass. It's, oh, the, the dirt patches and the grass deterioration is so bad in this game. It's definitely gotten worse already, I feel like. Whoops. Nope, that's, that's been a money rock quite a few times, that one. Not today. So what have we got? Like five fossils potentially. Maybe one's a... Maybe one's um, a pitfall. Or a gyroid maybe. I forgot because it's been snowing. There's, there's probably some gyroids there. Okay. I'm really going to have to start planting some trees behind the rocks. To make things easier. Okay, is that Octavian? Let's see if we can give Octavian an orange. Oh, hey! Mori, have you ever found that no matter how many of your own you own of one thing, you keep buying more? Yeah, Animal Crossing games. <laughs> For me, whenever I see a green table, I can't help um, breaking it out of my wallet. So I ca can I interest you in one of my extras, say for, oh yes, we'll take that because green is one of the feng shui colors. Uh, you're a shrewd negotiator, Mori. Okay, let's do this thing, Ace. Thank you. Great, now I'll be traveling a lot lighter, thanks. Can we give you an orange? Ah, Mori, what's going on with you? Take this. I'm hoping this is initiates... Oh, we can't give them oranges. What? Okay, have a regal dresser instead. I know you collect green furniture, but take it. Hey, kiddo, you know this isn't beige, right? Oh! Listen here, you've brought me a regal dresser, but what I want is stuff that's beige. You see the difference, right? Try to develop more... Oh, wow, just... Just, just bite my head off and 
shoot me down, I guess. Wow, that we just got a telling off by uh, Octavian. That was a bit uh, unexpected. Beige items. Well, we'll have to remember. Oh, look, there's another fossil. Okay, let's head inside our house and just put the green dresser down. Um, it should help our feng shui. Um, and I don't think green is responsible for money luck, but it's I think it's general luck anyway, or friendship luck maybe. Uh, how big is this going to be? Is this going to be a huge table? Um, let's see. We'll just drop the... We really need some music in our room. There we go. That is a big table. Tape deck can be placed on the table. Okay, excellent. Um... Okay, that will, oh, that's really annoying that the, the the tape deck is the wrong way, but we should be able to put the bonsai on here as well. So green items need to be placed along these tiles here so we've got one two three green tile uh three green items and two yellow items i don't know we have there's just nothing else we can do that's yellow is there um oh he get he gave he didn't even take the regal dresser he gave it back okay let's put the chess pieces in here for now because we haven't got a big enough house for the chess pieces we can sell those Um, oh yes, we need to build more snowmen. Let's keep the regal dresser for now then. Okay, we need to go back to find the money rock. Maybe that one table helped our luck enough that we might get more time to get the money rock. I swear it's a thing. We've got some new hourly music now. Very wintry. Where's the other rocks? There's a rock somewhere that we are not seeing. <laughs> okay, it must be this one. No! the rock there's not one behind our house is there I'm sorry I keep bringing up the Wiimote by accident today um, you have to excuse me look there's another one another fossil they've got to be gyroids haven't they there's got to be a bunch of gyroids oh, I'm really sad about the grass deteriorating Kusto where are the rest of the rocks Help me! Did we do this one? Yeah, we did this one. Okay, sorry about this. We're just hunting down the money rock. Oh yes, we haven't been up here, have we, today? Hey! Whoops! <laughs> Freckles, Maury, you're just in time! Hello, you! Say, do you like happen to have a little spare time? I'm looking for someone who can make a delivery for me. I'm kind of swamped right now. Yes, please! I want to do the work. This is one thing that the GameCube had that for... Every generation it did less and less and that's the villagers just offering you work. Um, you can literally ask any time in the GameCube version. Okay, you just got to get this to Pango. Oh, and one more thing. This one needs to boogie. Oh, okay. It has to get there by 2 p.m. Oh, okay. We've got an hour. 
Okay, so I don't know where Pango lives down by the sea, I think. Pango, is that you? I thought I heard a villager. Nope. Where does Pango live then? Pango's house. Oh, we get to go inside and have a look. Okay, let's check out Pango's house. I can't, I don't think we've been in many villager homes yet, actually. Uh, we could use some ideas for our own decorating. Oh, hey, we've got a, a screen that you might like. Pango, oh, Popstar, is something like wrong? Uh, mail call. Here you go. We've got a present for you from, oh, wait, who is it from? I can't remember. Was it Freckles? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> oh, it's from Freckles. That was totally fast. Yeah, it was. No way. Oh my gosh. It's a closed closet. I'm totally going to cry. Thanks, Popstar. You're the greatest middleman ever. I hope no one ever cuts you out. <laughs> oh, I, I see what you did there. Tell Freckles that she totally rocks. Oh, we are we not going to get an award for this? Okay, we'll uh, head back to... Freckles then, and just tell, or just announce politely that we delivered the package. I'm super glad that it's snowing as well. Okay, Freckles, are you still over here? Freckles, oh Maury, is something like wrong, ducky? Delivered. Maury, hey, thanks for making that delivery for me. You totally rock, Ducky. Come to think of it, I owe you one, huh? Okay, hold on just a sec. Check it out. It's wood paneling. Yep, all yours. Oh, thank you. Um, my gratitude was a pile of mashed potatoes. It would reach to the sky. It's nice to know that you'll help out in a pinch. I'm going to take these yellow roses as well. Okay, we're missing a rock somewhere. We'll check down below the town hall. Hollow, hey. Where is the last rock? Did we do this one? No, we didn't do this one. I think we walked past this one, didn't we? <laughs> Come on, last bell bag. You can do it. No. Oh, well, we will get that last bell bag one day. Um, I wish they would just put these straight in our pockets. Okay, at least we've got some bells. We can go back and get that chess piece and check the turnip price before we forget. And buy some paper. Because we want to use our keyboard and send some mail to the villagers. That's what, one of the other, only other ways I can think of getting things from villagers is by mailing them every day. So we need to buy some paper. Okay, Nook and Go, here we are. I love the fact that you can see the items through the window. That's so cool. It's such a neat little detail. Ah, welcome. Your home renovations are done. Did you take a look? Now you've got a nice, uh, got a bit more room. Nice. Yes, yes. So about the matter of my fee, that will be 120,000 bells. Ouch. Uh, it's quite a lot. <laughs> um, of course, you know you don't have to pay it all right now. Like before, you can wire me the payments from the bell point in the town hall. Take your time paying me back, it's fine. Yes, yes. Just keep coming by the store to buy goods when it pleases you. Oh, Tom looks a, a, a good raccoon, really. Uh, okay, let's sell these oranges first. Yes, yes. Tell me, what can I do for you? I want to sell. Get these out of our pockets first. 
sell. Ah, for all of that, I'll give you 300 bells. And then we want to check our turnip prices. Thanks much. Anything else I could do? The last turnip price was like 63 bells, I think it was. Currently, one turnip sells for 128 bells. Ooh. <laughs> we would make a profit. But we only... I mean, we, we bought them at 93 or something like that. So that would be a profit. But I'm really tempted to see what they are tomorrow. I believe a spike happens on a Wednesday, so it must, it might be indicating that it's going up. I think for that little amount of profit, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll gamble it and see tomorrow. Ah, very good, Maury, you have a good eye. Today is special. The white, uh, yes, a white king, just 8,000 bells. Yeah, we'll take it. Just because it's expensive, but also it means we're donating 8,000 bells to the upgrade of Nooks again, so. Um, it's 8,000 bells, exactly. Yes, yes, thanks much. Okay, while we're here. By the way, I love the outfit, Tom Nook. Let's check the carpet. A round carpet. We've actually already had a round carpet, I think. Let's check the wallpaper. An ivy wall! Why are we getting repeated items? No! There's so many items in this game. Oh, lotus paper! Those come uh, four to a pack. Yeah, we'll take it. We need to write out some letters. It's 160 bells exactly. I think we'll give that suitcase thing a miss. Um, let's just check this machine while we're here. Welcome to the Nook Point tracking system. Basic member Maury, uh, visitor points. Maury, 12th January 2023, you have earned plus three points for visitor on Maury Dan's store. Can I help you with anything else? Total points. We have two, oh, well, oh we're nearly the, th the 300 is what we need. Um... Okay, so maybe we should buy some more things. Okay. That, we'll probably reach that tomorrow then. Uh, okay, let's... Uh, what were we going to do? Letters. We're going to write some letters, send off these things, plant the roses, and we should be... Should be good. Four presents, four letters. Okay. We're going to spend a little bit of time writing some letters, uh, but it shouldn't take too long because we have the awesome keyboard. Um, RGB keyboard, it looks good. If you haven't seen it, it's on Twitter. <laughs> I'm very proud of it. <laughs> and it's super good value for money as well. Anyways, let's just plant these flowers over here. We're kind of surrounding our house with yellow flowers. Just to remind us that we're on the search for yellow items. <laughs> Okay, now let's head to the post office. I don't think it, it's not really going to do anything, but you can really see the, the grass disappearing here next to the bridge. It's really disappointing. I just want there to be lots of grass by the time it turns green. After that, I guess we can accept the grass deterioration. Um, maybe the best way to map paths is to be to lay custom designs, maybe. Okay, let's head inside the town hall to write our letters. I think get out of the chilly snow and then we'll write up four letters to four random villagers. Send off some presents. Recycling bin, pick up time, 6 a.m. on Monday. Oh, it's, it's been picked up today, Monday and Thursday. Okay, let's write some letters. We don't want to accidentally send the chess piece. So who should we write to? Let's just start at the top again. So we're going to say... Hey! Please... Enjoy this gift. If you want, you can... Send me some fruit! We... Need apples. Wow. <laughs> there we go. I know, I, I think you're supposed to fill up the letters, but that's okay. Hey, please enjoy this gift. If you want, you can send me some fruit. We need apples. Okay, we'll write out all the letters, then we'll drag the presents in. So next up, we'll write to Cousteau. Hey, you want to go bug hunting tomorrow? I need an expert. Also, oops. 
Here is a gift for you. Ah, I can't spell. Here is a gift for you. There we go. We need to think up some cool things to write to our villagers. Um, let's make up some funny rumors. I heard you can tell the future. L O L. What would the turnip prices be tomorrow? Also, have a present. I hope you like it. There we go. I think one of the coolest things we could do actually is a bit of a fun game. Is think up some funny things to send to villagers. Like some funny rumours and things. So, dear Freckles, I heard that you could tell the future. What will be the tenant prices? Uh, what will the tenant prices be tomorrow? Also, have a present. I hope you like it. <laughs> um, I just think that would be quite a funny game. And then, if anyone ever reads the letters in the future, or we come back to some letters, it'll be really funny to see what we said. So, if you can think of anything we funny, oh, the letter section is full. Oops. If you can think of anything funny, let me know. Uh, from Pango. Oh yes. How do we throw a letter away? What? How do we throw a letter away? Okay, we'll have to write our other letter in a minute. Maybe we should save some letters. Okay, hey Pelly! How do we throw letters away? Or maybe we have to do it... Oh wait, do we... No, not... Do we do it in the recycling bin? Or maybe we have to do it outside! Oh no! We'd have to litter. Yeah, we can't reach our letters. Pelly, this is the town post office. What can I help you with? Um, we want to save some mail. We've got from the snowman, Kusto, Freckles, Apollo, Happy Room Academy. I might keep the snowman one as well. Uh, okay, now we should be able to write the other letter. Okie dokie, I'll go ahead and take care of that for you. Is there anything else I can help you with? Not at the moment. We're just going to quickly write one more letter. Okay, well, if you ever need something, feel free to stop by. Okay, who should we write this to? Um, let's say a daily reminder for Gigi not to leave. Hello, this is your daily reminder not to leave Moriland. We love you! That's what we'll put. Hope we're trying to convince Gigi not to leave. And we love you. Also... Is it true... Um, is it true... You're an alien. LOL. That way... Um, we're just making a bit of a funny joke. Just because I think it would be funny to read some letters in the future. Hello, this is your daily reminder not to leave Moriland. We love you. Also, is it true you're an alien? Um, and we can give Gigi a wallpaper. And that clears out our pockets a bit as well. Okay, let's mail the letters. This is the town post office. What can I help you with? Uh, we want to send some letters. So where would you like to send your mail? Moriland. I'm so glad we can do them all at once. There we go. Four letters. Four presents. Okay, I'll take care of it from here. Do you have any other letters you need to send out? Not at the moment. Thank you. Thank you for visiting and please come again. Well, thank you. Well, there we go. Another... Pretty productive day, I guess. Sorry it's a bit slow. Sometimes we just have to do some daily chores, I guess. But it was fun to check out Nook and Go. Sorry, Pelly, I'm making you run back and forth. Um, and we also sent some letters out as well. So we are pretty much on the search for yellow, red, and green items to make our house a bit more feng shui style better, I guess, uh, to increase our luck. So we're still going to work on that. Work on getting more items, explore some new places and things, hopefully. Uh, don't forget to let me know if you'd like to see a late night video so like say like 2 a.m or something like that 
Um, I would really like to see Wisp at some point and the UFO uh, and things like that. So let me know what you'd like to see, what you like, what you don't like, and any other games you'd like to see on this channel. I would love to know. Um, I'm here to make some cool videos, so let me know what you think is cool. <laughs> Thank you, of course, to the channel members for making this happen, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!